nice going. I get stuck with Travis Crook. What do you mean you get stuck with Travis Cook? I, I took it upon myself to add some levity to this program, to add some class to this program, to help your ratings, because you have your Battle Royal champion, one of the top stars in the wrestling business today, Brandon Espinosa out here, and someone like you, Keith Smith, is not qualified to commentate on this match. Why is that, Travis Cook? I'm the commissioner here in MMWA SICW. You're just a lousy manager. Lousy manager? You, what makes you qualified to do anything, Keith Smith? You are a has-been who had a moderately successful wrestling career. Brandon Espinosa is a man who just got through wrestling for Ring of Honor. Brandon Espinosa is a man who's on the fast track to being a top national star, unlike you. Don't forget Ace Hawkins just got through wrestling for Ring of Honor as well. I understand you were there, and that's great. You did you did very well. You accounted very well for yourself. But don't forget that the reason Brandon Espinosa wrestled for Ring of Honor is because I made the contact with him. I signed the contract. There was an open spot in that contract. They were nice enough to let you in, let you ride in his coattails, because they know he trained you. So they've got some respect for you in that respect. But uh, don't kid yourself. You were there because Brandon Espinosa was there. Now Max Archer... With a hammerlock, I gotta say this for Max Archer. He's not that experienced, he's not that bright, but he is quick. Wait a second! Hey, guess what? I think your champion just hit the mat on his back. Ah, but look. Oh, come on, Brandon. Wait a second, wait a second. Okay, timeout, 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 timeout. Is that what you were saying about Brandon? Yeah, he's, what got to say? he's lulling him into a false sense of security. See? He suckered him in. He suckered him in. That's something you haven't learned yet, Ace. But Brandon Espinosa has the experience to let an opponent think. Look at that clothesline. Let an opponent think he's on the advantage when he's really not. It seems to me that Brandon has the experience to pull cheap knockout punches out of nowhere. That's why I'm not wrestling tonight. He gave me a concussion last Saturday. He gave you a concussion last Saturday, right? So the reason that you're not wrestling tonight is because he knocked you the blankety blank out. See, that's how good Brandon Espinosa is. He does not mess around. He does not come out here and high five these rednecks. He does not come out here and go flying off the top rope unnecessarily. He comes out here to out wrestle people, out fight people, and to win matches. Period. End of story. He recognizes that the name on the marquee is still wrestling. And he happens to do it better than just about anybody in the world. Mind you, I was the first person to kick out of the knockout punch. And you're still concussed, aren't you? And let me ask you a question. When you did when you did barely get a shoulder off the canvas after the left hook, did you or did you not win that match? I lost. You lost the match, right? Yeah. You lost the match. So let's... Oh! Nice double stomp! Nice double stomp. You know, Brandon Espinosa has some martial arts ability, as you see. Nice sent on cover. Count up one, two... Referee a little bit slow on that count. Let me tell you something there, Travis Cook. I can guarantee as soon as Ace Hawkins is feeling up to it again, in a very new, near future, Brandon Espinosa is going to be in a whole lot of trouble. Why would Brandon Espinosa be in a lot of trouble? You know what? Because of a manager like you who doesn't know when to keep his mouth shut, I'll make that match happen the second time. Hey, Brandon Espinosa has no problem wrestling Ace Hawkins. You know, he knows everything about Ace Hawkins. He taught Ace Hawkins. It would be another great learning experience for this young man. I'm not going to take anything away from Ace Hawkins. He's an impressive young athlete. He, he's in tremendous shape. He's got a lot of quickness. He could possibly have a good future if he just learns a little bit more from Brandon Espinosa. How about if he learns a little bit more from myself? You know what? I'm not dead. I can Could still, me. you know what? Hey, look here, Travis Cook. All the time that you think all these superstars in TNA, you know, Ring of Honor, where do you think they trained at, buddy? Who do you think trained the trainer of <laughs> ROH? Yeah, get it right. First of all, pal, the last time I saw, and I don't want to go rehash in the past, but I remember when you were a wrestler, I refereed some of those matches. Cover by Espinosa. Count him two. Come on, Brandon. Stay on him. Stay on him. Don't get frustrated, baby. Don't get frustrated. As I was saying, back when you were a wrestler, I was a referee for some of those matches. 
I remember when you wrestled the Honky Tonk Man, hopefully to get a contract with WWE. You lost. It didn't happen. I remember when you wrestled Superfly Jimmy Snuka. You lost. It didn't happen. Brandon Espinosa has already accomplished something that you never did. He wrestled for Ring of Honor, and you didn't. Let me tell you what, Ring of, Ring of Honor wasn't even thought of back then. And you know what? You're blind as a bat without them damn glasses on, and everybody here knows it. Can't see your hand in front of your face without them whatever you call it on I the have fake imitation glasses. I have 20-20 vision, and I see right now Brandon Espinosa with a double chicken wing, but Archer got lucky and kicked out of it. Uh-oh, come on, open that fist, ref, make him open that fist. Archer charges in with another illegal right hand. Looks like Brandy could le you learn a thing from me in quickness so we can handle guys like this. But, but come on, those are, those are close fist punches. Kick, Brandon, kick, there you go. There you go, that's what Brandon Espinosa has. He has staying power. 80% of the other wrestlers would have been beaten by that fisherman suplex. Good night! Brings back memories, doesn't it? Cheap shot knockout out of nowhere. I mean cheap shot. That was an open-handed shot. That was an open-handed shot. And Espinosa's got him where he wants it. Here it is! Trend center! Uno, dos, tres! And your battle royal champion wins!